I'd like to thank today's sponsors for this video, which is C4 Energy Drink. If you need to go nuts to butts, get yourself a C4. Okay, so I'm going to explain what we got going on here today. This is my newest patent pending, if it doesn't blow up, patent pending product. This is this is a, a choke tube extender. This is you have your you know, like modified full. We got super full. This is ultra mega amazing fucking full. Okay, this is 20 feet of choke tube extension. So I. <laughs> I'm gonna put some cardboard up there. I shot this regular gun, which I bought this gun just for this video. Uh, it was one gun store I always get a lot of guns from. Uh, I was like, yeah, I'd probably just take a single barrel there. He's like, why do you want a single barrel 12 gauge? Like, I, I honestly did. <laughs> I didn't even, I didn't even explain it to him. I was like, ah, I don't know, just to have, you know, whatever. So you can see it's kind of wavy there it I should have brought more saw horse saw horses that's kind of my bad but I'll try to unfortunately I'm gonna be firing this thing from the shoulder got my plate carrier fingers crossed anyway I'll try <laughs> it doesn't even look good at all I'll try to straighten it out but anyway the whole reason I wanted to do this is because I live in a mansion and from my bed to my solid golden doors uh, it's 69 feet so I need something that's gonna reach uh, from my bed to the door in case the intruder gets past all my tigers and lines and shit. So I wanted to, uh, yeah, still doesn't look good. So, uh, I, I kinda see, I wanna see if it actually holds the pattern at all. Uh, I was gonna just take the one off there and they're a 10 foot section, so I was actually just gonna shoot it with a 10 foot section. I think it'll, uh, it would do a lot better that way. I'll uh, show you real quick, like kind of what we got going on here. Flip it around. All right, so yeah, there's a single barrel 12 gauge. Uh, you got a <laughs> 12 by 36 by 80 ATN scope duct tape to the top because I need accuracy in my mansion because it's huge. It's just a joke, by the way. Uh, yeah, so there's this first section, 10 foot. And we got a compression coupler here, which I was gonna weld it solid, but. I think it's gonna fail there. I think it'll just blow apart there, and hopefully I don't get hit. So there's the other section, and of course at the end, in case <laughs> in case the intruder makes it past all that, uh, I got a Rambo knife zip tied to the end. So let's see if well, let's see if it explodes, and I don't know. Let's just see if it works, and then if it does, I'll. Maybe I'll take that one section off and we'll try that too. Oh God. Okay. <laughs> Safety. I'm so scared. <laughs> oh, dude, it worked awesome. Broke right where I said it would, but let's go check it out. It worked good. Ooh, fucking knee. Check it out. So, I wasn't even worried about ear protection. I figured it wouldn't be loud. And, you see it? Yeah, I was a little scared. I was like, shit. But look at that pattern. Hell yeah. I'll compare it to the other one. You can see, I thought that might happen. Like the BBs were either swirling or tumbling. I actually ordered a, a chronograph to, I was gonna check the velocity on it, but. I brought a couple watermelons. We can see if he'll crack a watermelon. But hell yeah. Good start. Okay. <laughs> Safety. I'm so scared. <laughs> oh, dude, it worked awesome. Broke right where I said it would, but. Okay, I'm gonna just try with just the 10 foot, 10 foot section here. Uh, I checked to make sure like the choke to, or the, the wad wasn't stuck in here. So I feel a lot more confident. And we're gonna see what this does. Put my awesome shades on here. I don't think I'm gonna put the vest over. I think it'll be okay. Famous last words, brother. 
I think it will be okay. Here we go. Oh, dude, that works awesome. Yeah, definitely gonna have to patent this. So check that out. So that that's about ten foot there. Ah. Uh, so I was trying to keep it thirty feet. Probably not quite thirty feet from the gun. I'll back it up some more, but. I'll show you like the 30 foot without my patent pending choke tube extension. Uh, let's see if we'll break a watermelon. Okay, I got a watermelon up there. Uh, it's clear. Let's try this out. Uh, I took the scope off so I could actually try maybe to aim it. I, well, I had it originally, I welded a nut on the end, but I ran out of wire. Like as I was doing it, I was like, you know, it's good enough, but it fell off anyhow. So we got a watermelon up there and let's see. I can actually aim this thing. I feel a lot better shooting it. Yeah, this thing aims like a like a regular shotgun. Oh hell yeah. I sniped that thing. Like, no lie, <laughs> if you actually made a shotgun barrel, like a 10-foot one, I think it'd do good. Because look, I, I mean, I blew that watermelon up, and uh, I didn't even hit the bucket. That was a sniper shot. I mean, it's a little awkward, but I think it'll be a good home defense gun. I really do. I think it'll work good in my mansion. Oh, yeah. Okay, I got a whiskey bottle on top of the hill up there. <clears throat> I drank the whiskey first, so we're good. Uh, I don't know if you can see it up there. I'm going to see if I can shoot it from here. Wondering in case you wonder if you can shoot it like this. Yes, you can. Eh, I don't know. I'm still kind of scared about that though. There we go. Let's see if I can pick her off from here. Oh yeah. Kind of figured I was aiming a little bit high there. Well, yeah, looking down there, but still got it. Yeah, there might be something to this. Okay, so I shot it. All the way up there. That's a good, I bet you're close to 50 feet. 40, 50, pretty far. See, it's spread out a little bit more, more but yes, yeah, so that was the one pretty close, but yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, that's smaller than my hand. See so yeah, how these choke tubes work? Okay, I don't know if you can really see that, but this is the shotgun without my patented choke tube extenders. Uh, I mean, that's a, uh, got big hands and that's at 30 feet. So, I mean, really they, these were probably about 30 feet also. That's a 10 foot one, that's, that's a 20 foot. Actually, I think the 10 foot would just work better. I'm gonna put this up further than 30 feet and see what it does, see what the pattern is. Okay, well there it is, there's the patent pending choke tube extender uh, I say it'll go good with the muzzle enhancer right I made so that way when I take this to the, the range people will know hey I'm important you know it might work good for turkey I don't know but yeah I definitely don't do it at home though because I got pretty lucky I think yeah it worked it was fun time to clean up this mess I guess that's the best part